Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and I am here with a new video. In this video, I am gonna show you how I did a complete makeover of my entryway. Let's get started. This was the look of my entryway before and I wanted to give it a complete makeover. I decided to use a wallpaper because time and budget was limited. Before ordering the wallpaper, take the dimensions of the wall where you are going to apply it so that you don't end up ordering too less or too much of wallpaper. The height of the wall where I was going to apply it was 4.5 feet and the length was 13 feet. So the area comes out to be 58.5 square feet. Then I went to Amazon.ca and I searched for peel and stick wallpaper. There are tons of wallpapers available on Amazon but I went with this look because this was looking like little hand painted thing and I wanted my wallpaper to look like this. Next, I had to calculate the area of the wallpaper available on Amazon so that I order right quantity of the wallpaper. The dimensions given on Amazon are in inches, so first I have to convert them into feet. 17.7 inch is the width of the wallpaper, so I am gonna divide it by 12 and it comes up to be 1.4 feet. And then next, it is one. 118 inches long so I'm again gonna divide it by 12 so it's 9.84 feet long next I'm gonna divide both dimensions that will give me area of the wallpaper so the area of wallpaper is 14.46 square feet now I'm going to take required amount of wallpaper and then divide it by 14.46. Suppose I'm going to require 100 square feet of wallpaper, then I'm going to divide it by 14.46. It comes out to be 6.9. That means I require um, almost 7 rolls to apply on the wall. Make sure before ordering you consider wastage as well for the walls with windows and doors. So I'm gonna order it now. I've received my package from Amazon and I'm excited to open it. The wallpaper is really beautiful and the quality is really great. Okay, the roll is quite heavy so what I'm gonna do I'll take a rough measurement of first application and then I'm gonna cut it make sure your wall is completely clean before you start applying the wallpaper Somehow I forgot to take the recording for first application but I'm gonna show you the process in next one. For the second application again I measured it roughly and then I cut it from here. The very important part of this project is you have to make a pattern when you're applying second layer. If you join the lines, it will make a pattern but if you don't join the line in the second layer, it will spoil everything. When I'm sticking the second roll, I have to make sure the lines are overlapping the first one so that they make a pattern. And the sticking process is very simple just remove the backing paper a little bit and stick the top part and then use a taping knife to remove bubbles and keep on removing the backing paper at the same time and using the taping knife 
so that there should not be any bubble in this process. Trim off the extra wallpaper with the help of cutter knife. Follow the same process towards the end of the wall. I trimmed off extra wallpaper in the end. And here comes the decoration part, a console table, a round gold mirror, a book with a golden decoration, a plant, a lantern, a vase and another succulent and a big plant and this is the final look of the wall the whole makeover was under hundred dollars and it really gave my entryway a classy and charming look if you like this video please give me thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel i'll be back with a new video soon bye bye for now